तो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस मॉड्यूल आई विल डिस्कस ब्रीफली ऑफ कोर्स नॉर्मलाइजेशन इफ यू रिकॉल दैट इन द प्रीवियस मॉड्यूल नंबर वन जीरो थ्री वी एंडेड एट नॉर्मलाइजेशन एंड द पर्पज ऑफ नॉर्मलाइजेशन वॉज टू एफिशेंट मेक एफिशेंट डेटा बेस एक्सेस टू इन्हेंस द परफॉर्मेंस एंड ऑफ कोर्स वी वी बी लुकिंग एट द नॉर्मल फॉर्म्स विच आर देयर वेन वी परफॉर्म दिस नॉर्मलाइजेशन सो लेट्स लुक एट दैट so we have uh, of course there are five normal forms and then there are additional ones also i'll cover the basic four ones in this module so why why we do normalization let's let's explain it to you using certain examples and then things would be clear to you okay first normal form now uh, look at this simple table layout over here so why we have this table layout because say for example people come for appointment it's a doctor's database and people come for appointment and this appointment is based upon the time and the location and the title of course that doctor has a uh, different clinics at different locations okay and the title is that for which job that person is coming for which kind of a treatment now what is uh, evident from table 1 table 1 is very this is very basic kind of a table to store is that there are repeating groups over here so we have this this is getting repeated this is getting repeated over here so this is lot of wastage of space so this is one reason why we need to have the first normal form then is uh, if we if we are looking to perform a search now the the thing is that if we are doing a search say for example on name is equal to x okay now there can be multiple people who might be having this kind this x over here okay there can be multiple people so which x are we talking about the big question mark over here so what happens that everybody comes up with their own solution so there are diversity of solutions and those diversity is not very formal and the end user can make some suggestions or some people say put multiple values in a column which is against the relational model and so on so the most the best solution is or the right solution is two tables okay so we have this table over here and we have this table over here and as you can see over here is that there is no limit we don't have to assign any space over here okay we don't say that for 10 appointments okay or say for 50 appointments or like 5 appointments so the number of appointments can can vary so these are just those rows are added in this appointment database and over here we have this name of that person which was x over here right so there is no ambiguity why there is no ambiguity because now we have the sequence number over here and that sequence number is the primary key that is the unique base upon which we can combine these tables so that is why we need the first normal form now what happens is that uh, there are many instances there are many uh, examples there are many cases that we cannot place the data in very nicely in the type of the solution i showed you in the last slide okay so not all databases can be uh, organized as in the table 2 okay now what would be the example of repeating group in the case of table number 3 okay now is this a repeating group or this is a repeating group okay this is a repeating group so this is this is not very simple now remember one thing that is when we have this repeating group right and it is consuming space now when we split the repeating groups we split the repeating groups of course that results in saving of the space but there is a slight processing time also because we have to refer two tables which is called as a join also so we have to take into consideration the space time trade off with a with the web based application so you have to take into this thing the count therefore we are performing this normalization okay now second normal form now when we have now anybody who is uh, kind of a new to this domain would say i can store all the data in one table why use two tables the purpose of two tables is synchronization of this redundant data because if if you have a single table and you have repeating then if there is a change you have to make the change everywhere so if you don't do this uh, second uh, normal form what will happen that 
यू के हैव यू मे हैव टू डिफरेंट अकाउंट्स ऑन द सिंगल क्रेडिट कार्ड विच इज रॉन्ग सो वी आर नॉट ओनली ट्राइंग टू सेव स्पेस बट ओनली ऑल्सो इंश्योरिंग दैट द डेटा इज एंटर्ड ओनली वंस द बेनिफिट अनदर बेनिफिट इज दैट इफ द आइटम हैव बीन शिफ्ट and there is a change in the address you don't have to make that change everywhere only at one place so that is the benefit of this second normal form now the third normal form and the fourth normal form let me briefly talk about the third normal form is that if i have the table in which i have the zip code and the name of the town also then there is a dependency between the zip code and the town because in many cases say for example the customer may only provide you the zip code or only provide you the town name right so it would be kind of incomplete so if there is dependency we we remove that dependency and in in what happens is that the zip code table is separate the name of the town corresponding to that zip code it is in a separate table i think you get that point so what would be the uh, benefit that it would be incomplete versus simple design now for the zip code case there are not many many uh, towns they are not like in hundreds and thousands they are less than that significantly less than that so we can have this simple design right but for other scenarios say for example i have a customer database i have a million customers and then they have these uh, appointments for example for this insurance company then this kind of thing is not going to work and finally the fourth normal form is that say for example there is a meeting with at at a, at a certain time and at a certain place between two people now the question is is that a joint meeting or it's a conflict so that conflict is considered over here and that's why we are saying that two types of relations are not allowed so that is the fourth normal form so that's all i have for you in this module thank you very much